Hey guys, and welcome back to some more Risk of Rain. So, it has been such a long time since I played this game. Like, for you, it's only been about three, you know, two, three days since you've seen the last episode of Risk of Rain. But for me, you know, all those eight parts, I sat there and I recorded that, and I divided it into eight parts, and then every three days, a part would go up to so pretty much 21 days, so almost a month of me not playing this game. <laughs> So we're just going to hop right into it, so I'm actually going to continue on with the whole introducing you guys to every character, and actually I had an update while I was gone, there are these little artifacts that you can find in the stages, so, you know, if I come across one of them, I guess I'll pick them up, but I'm not really interested in them yet right now, but, uh, I'm going to continue on just, you know, playing the character, so now we're going to play as the bandit, and then we're going to play as a character that I don't have unlocked yet, and then we're going to play as Handy and all the characters down here, so, uh, let's get started. Alright. Bandit is an interesting class. Bandit used to be the most broken class in the game, and then he got nerfed, and now he's not. Uh, he used to do extreme amount of damage, and didn't really know how to calculate his damage. So, yeah, pretty much they just couldn't figure out what to do with him. But after they balanced him, he hasn't been as good anymore. People really don't play with him. I, I still enjoy him. Um, when I, I used to not be able to play him at all, because my previous Xbox controller, uh, its A button was broken, and literally, uh, this character pretty much, it's kind of like the commando, except for, except for when I shoot, that's me pressing, and that's pretty much, the, they had to cap that, so, literally, I can, I can literally spam the shit out of the A button, but, you know, he's only gonna shoot so fast, but, you know, the whole gist of it, of the character was, you know, you know, shoot as fast as you can hit the A button, so, you know, people can, you know, spam the shit out of the A button and, you know, get so many hits that the enemies couldn't even move or attack you or even get close to you. So, you know, they had to neuter him. So, you know, he's still based on his shoot, so I can, I can shoot slow, I can shoot faster and faster and faster until I get to the cap amount of speed that he can shoot. But, uh, yeah, that's pretty much what made him broke, is that you could just shoot a whole bunch of time and he had really high damage with his move. And his move is called Headshot. Yes, and you can see that one right there, it's the last skill, and it pretty much looks like a guy with his face shot out. And it, it does a lot of damage, and the thing with the character is, if I can actually get the the last, the, the la, the, if the last shot I do with headshot is a kill, then I get all my skills cooled, reset, reset, cooled down, oh my god, etc. All my, all my cooldowns, um, all my skills are reset. So, that's pretty much it. And there's actually a, a thing that I actually wanted to unlock. So I'm gonna kind of do it. You pretty much gotta do reset your your skills 15 times, and you unlock a new item. So I'm gonna try to do that, and uh, you know that'd totally be my goal for this 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 pretty much this episode. It's one of my goals. So you know, hopefully I can pull it off. All right, so you're nice and ready to be headshotted. There you go. I was worried that I was gonna miss that jelly because if I missed that jelly, I was gonna be like, ah, oh, and I gotta start over. So I'm gonna take a little bit longer to, you know, get started than I usually do here, but, yeah, you know, don't mind me. I just wanna complete this mission. Like I said, if I complete this mission, I unlock an item, so definitely unlocking items are what I want to do. The more items I unlock, bah, the, you know, the more, <laughs> you know, versatile my, uh, my item pool is, and then, you know, the more percent I can get done with the game. That should be enough. And I'm trying to get it. I'm trying to get it. I definitely want that blade. That blade shall be mine. I don't care about anything else in there. Rusty blade. See, I don't want to mess this up. So if, if, yeah, I had a feeling that I would hit, maybe hit, accidentally hit the other one. So, there we go. I was worried, I was like, eh, can I kill him? But, yes, I could. So, I apologize, you know, not really getting started in this episode. You guys are probably, like, sitting there, like, you know, when are you really gonna get started? Like, no, don't worry. Don't worry. When I complete this mission, we're gonna, we're just gonna go, you know, our usual routine. But for right now, let me go ahead and handle this. The happiest mask is a tier 3 item that whenever I kill an enemy, I summon a ghost of that enemy. So you will pretty much see it, like, right here in a second. Boom! There's a ghost of him. See? And the ghost fights on me. Um, not fights on me. Fights on my side, with me. And, uh, yeah. I wish these guys would be separated. So I could get this headshot right. 
because it's going to be awkward to shoot this. Oh, now it's going to be really awkward to shoot this. Really, really, really awkward to shoot this. There's a lot of enemies spawning. I mean, I'm still on very easy difficulty. It's just a lot of enemies spawning. I need to, you know, give me, give me like one enemy so I can make sure that when I headshot him, he's going to die. Because right now, there is way too many enemies everywhere. Ow, that hurt. Oh my god, the fucking happiest mass. Oh, they fucked me up. Wait, right, now I gotta start over. I shouldn't have got these items. You know what? You know what? I'm gonna start over this run. I'm gonna start this run over. Start it over. Start it over. Uh... How do how do I conf how do I confirm how do I there we go I apologize peoples apparently it's X I apologize yes that's the character I want to play as play I don't mean to start over but I want to complete this mission I want to complete the goal of doing 15 consecutive but the damn enemies freaking mess me up so you know what I'm just gonna freaking Take it slow and do this myself. I hate that all the enemies are like together, you know? I wish I could get them one separate, so that's one headshot. So like I said, I need 15. Ow! What the fuck? Okay, that wasn't cheap at all. I'm sitting there climbing up the rope and those motherfuckers are like, oh, bounce up and hit you. <laughs> like, oh, you dick. Two. Three. We are going to do this. I want that item. I don't know what... I can't remember what it is, but I want to get it. Four. Fifteen seems like such a far number away. I don't know what count I was at, but I'm, I'm kind of mad that that fucked up. That, that the happiest max fucked me up. Was that five? I think that was five. I think that was six. I'm already losing track of, of the count, so that, that's good. That's great. It's going well. <laughs> Pow. You know what? I'm not going to grab any items. I'm not going to touch anything, because that's literally what messed me up, is getting those items. The bleed was messing me up, and the happiest mass messed me up, so no. I'm just gonna do this by myself. Spawn, spawn some enemies. Come on, spawn some enemies like in this general area right here, so I can just kill them real quick. That's all I want to do. I don't care about anything else right now, except for completing this mission. I haven't even introduced any of his other skills or anything. He actually has two more skills, but I haven't introduced them yet because I'm just trying to focus on doing this. You know what? Yeah, I would say just kill you, and I'll just headshot you. There you go. So I'm pretty much going to take all you guys out until there's only one of you left. Alright, I can introduce another skill, so that's a little uh, little stun grenade attack that he does. It's, it's, it's okay. The reason why people now don't like him as much as the commando is because the commando has the dodge roll and the full metal jacket, so pretty much... Overall, he's just way better than this character, but I, I'm, I still like the bandit. I'm still, I, you know, I've I've won a couple runs with the bandit, so you know, I, I totally don't mind him. I'm gonna kill some of these jellies here. Well, one of the jellies here, and then we'll headshot the other one. Oh nope, or we can just kill them both on accident. Or we can just kill them both on accident. Come here. Bam! Those guys are still just waiting for me. They're like, come on, come down here. Come down here, I'll fuck you up. I'm like, no, 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 no. Just gonna stay up here. Ooh, that's a great wisp. Are there enemies down there? Oh, it's just a greater wisp. I'll go ahead and take him out real quick. And now there's enemies spawning down here, and now I'm not gonna take him out. I'll deal with him in a sec. Ah, oh, the imps just had to join along. They had to, they had to come too. They were like, "Oh no, 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 no!" 
Don't forget about me. And then now the golems are spawning. I would take one golem, but I really don't want to fight two. This game does not just want to give me what I want. I have to do this on easy mode instead of medium mode. Now the enemies are spawning in groups now. There we go. If you guys want to play Risk of Rain, you guys can go ahead and pick it up. I believe the game is $10, I want to say. It's totally worth it. It's totally worth the $10. Like, you'll get hours and hours and hours, endless hours of gameplay and fun on this game. So, it's, it's worth the $10. Definitely. I'm glad I picked it up. Am I almost done? I, lo I stopped counting a long time ago, but am I almost done? <laughs> God, I've just been sitting here shooting people over and over and over and over and over and over. Like, I would love to hit the teleporter, you know? I'd love to continue on right now. It's all about that item. It's all I want. Oh my god, I was just about to get him. I was just about to get him. I accidentally killed that guy on accident. There! Whew! And that's what we unlocked. Uh, the hit list. That's actually a pretty good tier 3 item, so... Glad that we finally completed it. It only took me a millennium. But we did it. Uh, get over here, Jelly, so I can kill you. Alright, we need to find that teleporter. Uh, spreading egg. You're outside of combat, I'm sure. Alright, the other move that he has is kind of like a smoke screen where I, you know, go invisible and, uh, I run a little bit faster. Not bad. It's, it, like I said, it's no dodge roll. It's, it's cooldown is way longer than, you know, the commando, so once again, the commando beats him in that department as well. Look at that cooldown, that's way too long. And I believe that there's actually an artifact in this stage, but I don't think I can get it, because I'm not the right character. Most of the artifacts, you gotta be the, the, the miner to get, and I don't like the miner. Yeah, it's over there. I don't like the miner. He's probably... Mmm, yeah, I'd say my le most, least favorite character in the entire game, so, yep, that's what I think of the miner. <laughs> spike strips, uh, spike strips are the worst item in the game. They're just completely shitty, like, no. Not, not good. No, no, no. You can see, we're getting a lot of golems, elites, and stuff. Got my grenade at him. Appear in smoke. Hit that teleporter and all the enemies spawn. Everybody and their mother wants a piece of me right now. I'll go ahead and go. Invisible. Hop out over here. They're like, oh, whoa, where he? how did he get over there? And I'll be like, oh, surprise, I'm actually over here, not over there where you thought I was. I don't want to sound too retarded. I don't want to get stuck there. If I, if, I, if I sound retarded like that and I make that voice, then I start sounding like Peanut Butter Gamer, so. <laughs> if you guys don't know who Peanut Butter Gamer is, then you're missing out because he's a pretty good YouTuber. I like Peanut Butter Gamer. I also like living, but I'm probably going to die. Yeah, I'm going to die. That's a given. I took way too long. Yay, broke every bone in my body. 